Hi, this is Charlie Zeese with Stargate Pyramids. Today I want to talk to you about a topic that uh, has been at the back of my mind for some time. Uh, I have known, because I do this for a living, that uh, a lot of the product that's out there that touts itself to be a Russian pyramid actually doesn't even come close to having the proper geometry. And as Lisa and I have recently done videos discussing our holiday sales, it, it hit me that we, I really needed to do a video, uh, not to tout myself, but to give you some education. Uh, if you're thinking of getting a pyramid for yourself or a loved one, uh, as to, and you want one that uh, has this geometry, uh, to educate you uh, so that you don't go out and spend money on a product that really isn't what you think it is. So uh, the purpose of this is not to denigrate my competition, but it is to let you know uh, which pyramids that are out there on the internet actually have the Russian, the actual Russian geometry. So that's the purpose of this uh, video today. Uh, I'm gonna get started. I have a presentation put together so you can see all of the information uh, that's necessary for you to become an educated consumer. So I'm going to open up the um, uh, presentation now. Uh, this is uh, the cover page that uh, I had originally uh, for, the, for this video. And we are today going to be discussing the actual geometry that's used in a lot of these so-called Russian pyramids that you'll find on the internet. So let's get started. To begin with, I want, because there's so much confusion, I've done this in my prior videos, but I wanted to go over again quickly the three major geometries, over, uh, excluding the Giza, which is very easy to detect because of its substantially different geometry. But there are three different pyramid geometries that are pretty close, and that's why there's so much confusion, not only am uh, amongst uh, a lot of the original researchers who did research on the Russian pyramids, but amongst uh, those of you in the buying public. So the first one I want to talk about is the Golden Pyramid. We're going to talk about two key components in each of these. Uh, the slant angle you'll see down here at the bottom right hand corner is 72 degrees and the ratio of height to base length is 1.539. Now you're not going to need to remember all this, but we are going to refer back to this as we go through the presentation. The Nubian pyramid geometry <clears throat> has a slant angle uh, of 72.828 degrees and a ratio of height to base length of 1.618 or 5. And we're going to be using those uh, two to compare to the Russian geometry, <coughs> which is substantially different in degrees, but it's a little more difficult to discern unless you have a trained eye for the difference when you actually see the pyramid. So now moving on to the Russian pyramids, which the Stargate Pyramid is based upon. Um, this is perhaps the most important piece of information that you can go and verify for yourself. And this comes from pyramids.ru. <coughs> and it says that the ratio of the height uh, to the base is 2.02. And that's easily verifiable. So anything that's close to that is going to be uh, the best approximation based upon these exterior dimensions uh, that are given on the pyramid.ru website. Now, when you take that uh, information and convert it into a slant angle, you come up with 76.1 degrees. Now, already you should be able to notice that the Golden and the Nubians had slant angles of 72 to 72.828 degrees. So we're going to see that a lot of the pyramids on the internet use that geometry as opposed to the geometry of the Russian pyramids. So they're off by quite a bit. Now we have refined this, and I'm not going to go into this in great detail. Uh, we have def uh, refined that uh, through studies in torsion physics, cosmometry, doing our own research on the geometries of uh, sacred temples and religious buildings throughout the uh, universe, the DNA and so forth. And we've revised that slightly 
uh, or more precisely to be 76.345 degrees and a ratio of height to base length of 2.058. <clears throat> a lot of geek speak here, but this is important uh, as we move forward. So uh, here is uh, the original definition as shown on the pyramid.ru website. You'll see the height to base length ratio is 2.02 to 1 and the slant angle 76.11, whereas the uh, revised geometry that uh, I've come up with is 76.345 degrees slant angle, and the uh, ratio of height to base length is 2.058. So keep those in mind as we move forward. Now this is the first, uh, there's two sets of these that we'll talk about. There's uh, uh, some folks that, that market a five foot and a six foot pyramid, both on eBay and Etsy. And if you look in the title, it's going to say five feet tall pyramid, Russian Nubian style. How, how confusing can that be? I know they do that to get uh, as many people to their site as possible. But the key factor here is this is marketed as a uh, Russian pyramid. Russian style, whatever that means. But if we go down to the bottom of the page, we're going to see where I'm pointing here, three lines from the bottom, that the base angles are approximately 72 degrees on this pyramid. Now, if you remember back, that slant angle is the slant angle of the golden geometry uh, pyramid, not the Russian pyramid, because the Russian pyramid even on the website is 76.1 degrees. So this is marketing, this is, this is false marketing. This is nothing close to a Russian pyramid in its geometry, and yet they're calling it a Russian pyramid. So this is not gonna be a pyramid that's gonna perform anywhere near like that which um, will when the geometry is more appropriate and correct. Now here's a six foot variation of that same pyramid. And you'll see once again down at the bottom, it's showing that the slant angle of this pyramid is 72 degrees. So if you see these on either eBay or Etsy, um, I know that they're inexpensive, they're less expensive than mine, but they're not gonna have the right geometry. I'm not gonna talk to the quality of the pyramid, which is a whole separate topic, uh, the quality of the connections and so forth, but I am gonna talk to the geometry in this discussion. So these are, four plus degrees off uh, in terms of their geometry. Now there's also some connectors that are available, a uh, half inch and we'll see the three quarter inch variation as well. And again, you're seeing this term Russian style meditation pyramid. Uh, they're not saying it's a Russian geometry pyramid. And in fact, when we go down and look at the uh, geometry here, it says that the ratio of the base to the base length, to the top to the base length, is 1.618. Now that is the Nubian pyramid, not the golden, but the Nubian pyramid. That has a slant angle of 72.828 degrees. Again, substantially different from the 76.345 degrees that we um, have calculated, or the 76.1 a rough geometry that's found on the pyramids.ru website. And here we've got the same uh, variation in a three quarter inch uh, connector setup, uh, again, available on eBay and Etsy. So again, the, even the connector sets that are being sold there are being done uh, using the term Russian style when in fact, the geometry of those pyramids is Nubian and for over four degrees off the mark. Now, there are two uh, uh, suppliers. Uh, one is called Fisherman Online, eBay and Etsy. And I'll show you another one in a moment. Both of these uh, do use uh, the ratio of height to base length of 2.02, .02, which is found uh, in the uh, pyramids.ru website. So, uh, this uh, item is going to be very, very close to what we have come up with. And so if you're going to look for something inexpensive on the internet, uh, this one and also the bath store would be my two recommendations because once again, the bath store 
uh, has a uh, height to base length ratio of 2.02. And both of these, as I said, uh, would compare to the revision that I've come up with of 2.058 to 1 as the uh, ratio of height to base length. That was my cat who uh, jumped down. Sorry for that. Uh, so these two are going to be uh, very, very close to what uh, I've come up with in the past. And if you're looking for a kit that you can make for yourself, uh, these uh, would work adequately. And they're going to be just a little bit off, but they're going to be a far, far impro big improvement from um, the, uh, the other two that we've seen, which were Nubian and Golden Geometry. Now, the last uh, company that we're going to look at is a company called Phimoles. They don't make uh, connectors or pyramid kits, but they do make molds for making uh, pyramids. And so when you go to uh, uh, an expo, uh, you might see, uh, for example, Lisa Richards and others uh, are going to be having these desktop uh, size of pyramids. They are most likely getting their molds from Fine Molds, which is a company um, out of uh, Eastern Europe. Now, what I'm going to show you here, though, is even the Fine Molds, I have to tell you, are fantastic molds. And, and as you'll see, they have adopted the geometry that I've come up with, and it's wonderful. However, due to the fact that they historically marketed th their Russian pyramid as a Nubian pyramid, uh, which actually had a golden pyramid geometry. It's very confusing on their website to get to get this information correct. So you can see here that they actually have two different uh, types of geometries here. They have what they call a Nubian Russian 76 degree and a Nubian Russian 72 degree uh, pyramid that they offer. So we're going to look first at the what they call the, as you can see, the Nubian Russian pyramids that have a 72 degree angle, uh, slant angle. Now, I want to talk about the one on the on the left, uh, and I've got another slide for that. It's a unique slide, but I want to let those of you who are interested in these moles get the full appreciation of the confusion that's on this website at this point. Now, this is that same mold uh, it's uh, listed under the 72 degree angle, and you can see it's called a Russian pyramid mold, but yet it's under 72 degrees. We all now know that 72 degrees is golden pyramid, even though it's listed as Nubian Russian on the website. So highly, highly confusing. If you're interested in this type of mold with the uh, uh, rubber part inside that can be taken out, uh, I think what you ought to do is to call the company or email the company and get some level of, of understanding and precise understanding as to what the geometry of this is. And you might even want to tell them that 72 degrees is not the as they know the Russian geometry. Now, here's one of the more traditional 72 degree moles that they uh, are selling. And you can see here now they're calling this a Nubian pyramid even though before they were calling it a Nubian Russian pyramid. So uh, I've done the math on this. The 72, as I mentioned, actually equates to the slant angle of the golden triangle or pyramid, not the Nubian, which is 72.828 degrees. However, the, the ratio of height to base length, which you would figure by taking the height of 78 and dividing it by the base of 50, is equal to 1.56. Now, a golden uh, pyramid would have a height to base length ratio of 1.539. That's pretty close to that. But the golden triangle would be 1.618 uh, for the Nubian. So it's somewhere in between. Uh, so I'm not totally sure about that. However, we're not really interested in these uh, 72 degree moles. What we're really interested in is the 76 degree moles. As, as called on their website. Now, once again, they're calling them Nubian Russian 76 degree moles, when in fact, the Nubian geometry uh, uh, is not relevant in this case because the Nubian slant angle is 72.828 degrees. But when we go and check one of these 76 degree 
uh, as they're called Nubian moles, uh, when you look down into dig down to an individual mole, you do find that the ratio of height to base length is 2.062 versus, as I mentioned earlier, 2.058 for the Russian geometry that I've come up with, that's a slant angle of 76.345 degrees. And so it looks as though they are actually using, and they have told me that they are doing this, that they, the 76 degree is actually 76.345 degrees. And it looks like, and I've done this, I've checked this against all of their mole sizes, that uh, every time you do the uh, height to base length ratio, uh, it's coming to the equivalent of a slant angle of 76.345 degrees to the nearest millimeter of height. So uh, it looks as though when you go and get this, what they call the 76 degree mold, you're going to be fine. So in conclusion, lots of information here, other than the phi mold, moles for making desktop pyramids, we were unable to find any other pyramid maker on the internet whose geometry conforms to the 76.345 degree geometry that we've developed based upon our own extensive research into torsion physics, cosmometry, and our own original research dealing with uh, DNA, uh, religious buildings, uh, hats and other ceremonial objects throughout, uh, throughout the world. So with only two exceptions as well, the kits and connectors found on eBay and Etsy claiming to be Russian geometry pyramids are not even close to having the Russian geometry, but rather use either the golden 72 degree slant angle or the Nubian 72.828 degree slant angle. <clears throat> And that, and those vary roughly four degrees from the 76.345 degree slant angle uh, that we've determined for the Russian pyramid, or that's obtained from the rough dimension shown on the um, pyramids.ru website. So I would avoid those at all costs. Uh, I know they're inexpensive, but uh, they're just not the right geometry. Now the two providers who do have much more accurate geometry are the Bath Store and uh, Fisherman Online. Uh, and both of these conform to the exterior dimensions on the pyramids.ru website, resulting in a slant angle of 76.1 degrees, which is very close, only about uh, 2.245 degrees difference from uh, the calculations the precise calculations that we've finally come upon. So all, but although that difference may seem small, we have demonstrated that that difference has a dramatic impact on the energy fields produced. Uh, so we would certainly suggest that you uh, look at the video. We're gonna link that uh, at the end of this video that we've done showing the difference, the dramatic difference uh, even uh, in, the, in the geometry of a slant angle of 76.1 versus 76.345 degrees. However, uh, if you're, again, you know, cost constrained, I would buy one of these two um, uh, person's connectors uh, at, at, <laughs> without any doubt compared to the ones that are so far off from the uh, dimensions uh, that we've mentioned before. So finally, Although Fimoles uh, uses confusing and, I think, misleading names for their pyramid geometries, and a lot of that is legacy from having started with a 72-degree uh, golden geometry but called it Nubian for their Russian pyramid moles. These moles have uh, the slant angle uh, that is appropriate for the 76.345 degree sacred geometry uh, of the Russian pyramids. So I hope this has been helpful. Uh, as always, thank you for listening. Uh, tell your friends about Stargate Pyramids. Uh, subscribe, ring the bell, like this uh, video. And as always, we thank you for watching, and you have a great day.